the dead walked in Vancouver on Saturday afternoon. Hundreds of zombies gathered for the city's 12th annual zombie walk, parading down Vancouver's main shopping street, causing scares and earning photo ops. The event started back in 2005, when about 400 zombies marched into the city's biggest shopping mall and then took a train to the city's cemetery. It's sort of like the dress rehearsal for the zombie apocalypse. This walk takes place in several cities around the world at this time each year, and it's been happening here in Vancouver for about 12 years. And each year, it's getting bigger and gorier. It took me three hours. It only took an hour just to do my regular makeup, and then it took three hours to do the prosthetic, the latex, the、um, gum wax, and the gum blood. And then just doing the fake blood from the dollar store is very quick. So we'll just squirt it here and there, you know. She says she tries to improve the quality of her look each year, but it is the fun of the scare that keeps her coming out. I just like scaring people. I really like scaring people, and I like to. Experience of makeup, because when I first did this, it wasn't really that great. It was just a prosthetic, no blood, no nothing. The zombie walk is now sanctioned by the city, and the zombies get a police escort as they parade down the street. The number of onlookers now rivals the number of zombies as visitors try to get in close for a photograph or a laugh. Another zombie named Lindsay said she joined the zombie walk for ten years in a row and at two cities. No, it's just really fun, and it's really fun to scare people because you get a good reaction from a lot of the people that are watching. Like you get really close up and scare them. It's just a lot of fun scaring people. Everyone knows that.